Hi guys, it's Regina and I'm back with another mini. And this one's very special to me. It was of um, the twins' birthday party. And the mini is actually made of Gia. And she's the oldest of the two twins. And it was totally inspired by um, a mini that Bona had made. And this is the mini. And I love it. I love it so much. So this is a vintage hanger. And I just spelled out Gia with my Dymo label maker in pink. I love it. So pretty. And then this is the Sizzix dress die. And the paper collection I use is the Madeline paper collection. And each of the pages has been sprayed with the Pearl Glimmer Mist. And I just um, inked up the edges with Vintage Photo Distressing Ink. And so um, this is the Making Memories garment pin. And then this is a cake by Martha Stewart that was metal and so I just had to kind of jazz it up a little and I put um, the stickles, two different colors of the stickles and I love the way it came out. Really pretty. And then of course I had to add my tool. So that's what's holding the um, mini together and I just made bows out of the tool. And then I just um, use the large eyelets on each page. So right here I just spelled out her name, Gia, and then just put a birthday cake. So for the photos, I actually used um, this small punch. <laughs> this thing is huge. It weighs like a, two pounds. And um, it's a two by three oval punch, but I love it. I just want to do something a little bit different. And so I just stamped happy birthday in uh, the vintage photo distress embossing powder. And then I added um, the rhinestones in this center. And there's Gia and she was in the jumper having such a good time. And then on the next page, there she is in the high chair. So beautiful. And um, right here, this is a Prima ribbon that I had left over that Bona had sent me. And so I put some sticky strip underneath it. And then I put the ribbon on top and I kind of scrunched it up a little bit. And then um, these are the butterflies from the Madeline collection. And um, this was the floral piece that's part of the die set. And so I um, put a pop dot underneath it. And then I just put some UT embossing powder over it to give it that wet look. And then I added the butterfly. And then on the next page, there's a picture of myself and my baby, and she was hitting the piñata at the party, and she was having so much fun. And so this is a Prima flower, and I put some of the rock candy stickles on it, and then I put a Prima heart piece in the center, and then this was my ticket punch, so I punched out the shape, and then I used the... Um, Prima clear stamps and stamp the word together in the center and then I just put these rhinestones at the bottom and then on the next page there's daddy with the twins and I love this photo Gia's touching her brother so adorable she's 13 minutes older than her brother but he's like an inch taller and four pounds bigger heavier than her it's adorable so right here I just put the word proud with the Dymo label maker and I put a pop dot underneath it and just added the word dad. And then on the next page is a photo of all five of us. So I just put this flourish, uh, flourish piece and I just put the five Freedmans because that's what I call us. We're the five Freedmans, honey. And then on this page, this is um, one of my stamps that I had um, stamped with the stays on ink and then I uh, cut around it and then I just uh, glimmer mist it with the Wheatfields glimmer mist and just added this um, butterfly piece. And then on this side there's another Prima flower and um, I just put this little snowball piece in the center and here's a photo of the center pieces that I had made. I thought they came out really really cute. 
And then there's my baby girl. She had fallen asleep on my girlfriend. So I just added this piece that says Beautiful Dreamer. And then this is the back. I love it. This is another one of the Prima stamps. And this is what it looks like. And to me it represents my three children. But because it was of, of the twins, I just used part of the stamp. And so I heat embossed it with the Distress Ink in the Vintage Photo. And then I added this ribbon piece, which I love. It's like felt. And then over the leaves I added the um, Distress Stickles, uh, the Scattered Straw. And I just put Regina Friedman 2010. So thank you so much for the inspiration, Bona. I love, love, love this. So I'll be making one next of my son, Gil. So that's my mini, guys. I hope you like it, and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.